they all kind of have a favorability to them in some way, shape, or form. The gecko can really shrink down. <laughs> Itsy bitsy. <laughs> He's really great for just putting in your pocket. I tend to walk around with one almost all the time. Um, I may not be on the spectrum like my son is, but I'm just as much of a fidgeter. And again, if we're all honest, we all fidget to some degree. So I tend to keep one in my pocket all the time. Again, it kind of twists up. Holds up pretty good. I do make keychain versions of them, although I don't have any right now, but I did over the course of the last few weeks of December, I did make some keychain versions and those sold really well. So like I said, I've got the little geckos and then I have a few other, I've gone very sea creaturey for some reason, aside from, you know, the geckos and dragons. I've gone, I've got a fun little shark and this has the same pattern that the geckos do. They've got the same rainbow spectrum. And then again, showing off, I've got a few of the octopus and I have a few of the colored ones left right now. I don't know where my green one went, but I've got these four little critters or three little critters rather of different um, orange tints ranging from a bit of a gold to medium range um, oranges. And then I've got a dark green that is the same tone as this starfish here. And again, 